Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Lang. I'm a board certified optometric physician, a certified nutritional specialist. I'm the founder of Lang Eye Care and Associates and Fortify Vitamins. I'm also a daily syndicated talk show host, a show called Ask the Doctor. I've been hosting since April of 1993, multiple radio waves uh, throughout this country and live via the internet all over the world from 9 to 10 Florida time. Anyway, today we're going to talk about a super carotenoid called astaxanthin. Tough to say that, astaxanthin. You're going to hear a lot more about astaxanthin coming down the pike. Uh, many nutritional gurus are now starting to talk about the powers of, of astaxanthin, and rightfully so. Astaxanthin is a very powerful antioxidant. Remember, it is a super carotenoid that is in the xanthophyll family. It's in the family with lutein and zeaxanthin. Uh, we've heard about the, the power of lutein and zeaxanthin for retinal health. Well, astaxanthin may also benefit the retina since it is a, a powerful carotenoid. But it is a very potent antioxidant, a very high ORAC value. It stands for oxygen radical absorbency capacity. The antioxidant power in astaxanthin is much more potent than vitamin E, vitamin C, or beta carotene. So it's going to help to scavenge free radicals in the body. Ultimately, to combat against free radical damage in the body, slowing down age-related degenerative stages. So what more can we ask for? A very potent antioxidant. But also it's a very powerful anti-inflammatory. So all of you patients out there with inflammation in your body and inflammation in the eye, all of the itises, think about it, if you're an eye doctor listening or a patient that may have experienced some of these inflammatory conditions in your eye, keratoconjunctivitis sicca, which is dry eyes, iritis, uveitis, conjunctivitis, scleritis, retinitis, all of these things may benefit from astaxanthin. If you're consuming more on a daily basis in your diet or if you're taking a supplement with six milligrams of astaxanthin in it. So once again, a potent anti-inflammatory, it can actually decrease C-reactive protein, tumor necrosis factor. It can actually help uh, with series two prostaglandins, which is the pro-inflammatory uh, portion of the metabolic cycle. And we actually see that it actually can bring arachidonic acid down. I'm actually involved in a clinical study where we're utilizing blood tests with patients and concentrated triglyceride form omega-3, and we're adding, we're adding astaxanthin to it, and we're seeing the arachidonic levels, arachidonic acid levels coming down. That helps with inflammation. So a potent anti-inflammatory. Remember, the root cause of many diseases in the body and the eye is inflammation. So if we can control inflammation, once again, omega-3 fish oil is very good at doing that, and adding astaxanthin to that may complement it and may be a synergistic effect. So think about astaxanthin for inflammation. Now, something that really got me excited and mainly interested in astaxanthin a few years ago, I learned about some studies out of Japan, some double-blind placebo-controlled studies that showed that six milligrams of astaxanthin may improve your focusing ability, your accommodative ability up close. And me being in my 40s, I'm always looking for the, that magic pill, so to speak, you know, the fountain of youth. Astaxanthin may be a piece of that fountain of youth. It has been shown to improve that focusing ability that you lose as you age. Also, it's been shown to help reduce asthenotic complaints, tired eye complaints, fatigued eyes related to near point stress and computer use. So all of us are using the computer. We're doing a lot of close work. We're texting on our, uh, on our iPhones and, and we're all aging, hopefully gracefully. So astaxanthin may be something that helps eliminate a lot of the fatigue that you have from your daily job uh, related to near point stress and computer use. So think about six milligrams of astaxanthin for those benefits. Also, everybody wants to look younger. We all want to look as good as we can until we have two feet in the grave, right? So something for our skin is going to be great. Astaxanthin has been shown in studies to improve the texture of the skin and to help eliminate fine lines and wrinkles. So we're all going to go out and buy astaxanthin now because of that. Um, I have many patients that I've seen uh, their dermatitis is improving, dry skin improving, even patients with psoriasis when they actually combine the astaxanthin with a good triglyceride concentrated form of omega-3 fish oil. Psoriatic blepharitis, I've seen many patients improving dramatically on the combination of the two of these. So once again, to improve skin texture, help eliminate some fine lines and wrinkles, 
uh, six milligrams of astaxanthin is uh, the ticket and it uh, will help, sometimes quite dramatically. Also, for all of you athletes out there, or for anybody at any age, astaxanthin has been shown to improve muscle recovery and muscle endurance. Japanese Olympian athletes, I think, are actually utilizing it right now. I have many uh, competitors, uh, Ironman competitors and triathletes and professional athletes that are now using, utilizing astaxanthin. And subjectively, they're giving me testimonial, testimonial after testimonial. So it is good at muscle recovery and muscle endurance. So at any age, uh, if you're out there working out or you're an athlete, you may want to consider adding or supplementing your diet with about six milligrams of astaxanthin or eating wild Alaskan salmon much more frequently. Remember, astaxanthin, natural astaxanthin is not in farm-raised salmon. It's only in wild Alaskan salmon or wild-caught salmon. That's the type of salmon you should be eating. All right, what about cholesterol? It seems like everybody has elevated cholesterol this day and age. It's very vogue, right? And statin drugs are even more vogue right now. Doctors are writing statin drugs uh, like they're going out of style. So wouldn't it be nice to help bring your cholesterol down naturally without medication? So certainly astaxanthin is something that may help with that. Obviously, uh, proper diet, exercise, and there are some other nutrients out there that can help with your cholesterol. But there are studies out there that indicate astaxanthin may be beneficial for helping your cholesterol. So another reason to consume uh, astaxanthin. What about circulation? Many of us, as we age, our circulation becomes very poor. Think about it, peripheral neuropathy in our toes and our, our feet. Uh, diabetics are notorious for having poor circulation to the eye, developing uh, proliferative and non-proliferative diabetic retinopathy in the eye. So as a, as a physician, we all want to be able to improve circulation in our patients, especially as they age. Well, astaxanthin can do that. Studies have indicated that it actually cr crosses the blood-brain barrier and the blood-retinal barrier, improving circulation to the brain and to the eye. So as an eye care provider, I love that. We deal on a daily basis with patients with macular degeneration, uh, diabetic retinopathy, patients that have had occlusive arteries disease, uh, blocked arteries and blocked veins in the eye, uh, ischemic optic neuropathies related to blockage of blood vessels. So if we have something that we can add from a nutritional standpoint that may help decrease this from occurring, and who knows, after occurring may, may be somewhat therapeutic. We'll know a lot more after we studied it a lot more, but improving circulation is a good thing. So let's recap. Astaxanthin has some, some pretty good health benefits. Potent antioxidant, a potent anti-inflammatory, um, also improves accommodation. Uh, it has been shown to reduce accommodative stress and eye fatigue, especially for all of you working on the computer a lot. Uh, improves skin health, uh, muscle recovery, muscle endurance, lowers cholesterol, improves circulation, and there's a few other things that uh, astaxanthin has actually been shown to, to help, uh, and we can cover that at another time probably. But I got so excited about astaxanthin, and there wasn't many places that I could find astaxanthin at six milligrams for my patients, so I decided uh, to be proactive with the Fortify, Fortify Vitamin Company and actually create something called Fortify Focus. Fortify Focus uses six milligrams of astaxanthin, and we also take lutein and zeaxanthin, which are the other uh, carotenoids in the xanthophyll family that are very beneficial for ocular health. So the combination of these three is kind of like a triple whammy, I say, at helping to promote good ocular health. There's also some research out of Italy indicating that astaxanthin may be beneficial for retinal health. And when we combine it with lutein and zeaxanthin, who knows what could happen. Uh, but we do have many, many patients, thousands of patients throughout the country using Fortify Focus and benefiting significantly. Uh, we get testimonial, uh, you know, weekly about improved accommodative ability, uh, lessened amount of eye strain and eye fatigue, better skin health, uh, but we have all sorts of other testimonials coming in. So it is an exciting product. We've had it out for, uh, this is January of 2011. We've had it out about for about eight, nine months now, uh, and it's been very, very successful. So look to astaxanthin, go to the local health food store, ask your eye care providers about Fortify Focus or eat wild Alaskan salmon on a daily basis and start reaping the health benefits, not only for the eye, but the entire body. You can also call toll free 1-866-503-9746. That's 1-866-503-9746. Or check us out at fortify.com. F-O-R-T-I-F 
E-Y-E, fortify.com. If you have a question for me, go to uh, another website, drmichaellang.com, and there is a section, Ask the Doctor, on there. With that, I'm out of here. Have a great day.